Howdy do y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah Vita, if you don't already know, and if you do, then awesome. Welcome back. Yes, I know I look crazy. I actually just uh, filmed this video, but because I have my black and white filter on this, this is a different phone, so it's very laggy. Yeah, because I just went back and rewatched what I just did, and it... So I'm sorry for that, but if you can deal with lagginess, then awesome because my scary stories are in black and white so yeah <laughs> anyways um so yeah if you're new here then i do scary stories i do them at least once a month but i've kind of been i didn't do in the last two months i don't know why but i have plenty of scary stories um everything that i tell or you know say is something that's actually happened to me and I have witnessed and yeah <laughs> I'll leave that whole playlist below I think this will be number eight I'm not really sure but anyways uh yeah I love redoing videos I love that I can't pause but hopefully I won't screw up that much this time but anyway yeah so I, I got to where I like to do these and I do my hair also so and also if you're here to just watch me smoke uh sorry doing my hair tonight so anyway, yeah, and I, I okay. So today we're gonna talk about uh, another recent thing that happened. I know the last one I did was um, about at my best friend's house. <laughs> well, I've been going up there a little more often because she's going through some family issues right now, and I'm just trying to you know be there for her and her family. So yeah. <laughs> So I've been up there quite a bit and every time I'm up there, if y'all don't know, then shit happens and whatever. And I am very like in tune to that kind of stuff. Demons, spirits, ghosts, what have you. Paranormal things. Oh, and yes, I am pink curling my hair. <laughs> so. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. Which, I'll, yeah, I'll leave that all linked down below. I think I already said that. Sorry, I get distracted when I do stuff. So, maybe not the best decision. Um, but, yeah, and this one's not going to be quite as... I mean, it's still creepy, probably to some people. But, I don't know. To me, I'm just used to this kind of shit. So, anyway. Get to the point. <laughs> um, yeah. And I do, I do have some... Um, footage that I tried to take a court I if y'all see anything that let me know but I didn't see nothing basically you know we're sitting there we're trying to watch a movie it's kind of hard to watch a movie when you got a three-year-old not me her not me oh not me her <laughs> so basically kind of like my nephew whatever and I'm sitting there waiting for him to fall asleep trying to get him distracted and finally he does fall asleep after what seems like nine million years and, uh, yeah, we're sitting there and we're talking like we usually do. And we hear one of his toys go off in the living room. Now she does have cats, but, uh, there were no cat. The cat, I think the cats were in there with the, at least one of them was in there with us. And the other one was at the bottom of the stairs. I'm pretty sure. So yeah, there's that. And I was like, what the hell was that? And she's like, that sounded like one of his toys. I was like, oh God, here we go. Every time I'm up here. And it just kept doing it. Like it'd wait a few minutes and then it would go off again. And this is something like this kid never plays with. Like barely. And it, anyways, so I go to grab my phone because I'm like, oh, I'm going to take a picture. I'm going to take a picture. I'm going to take a picture. Or not to take a picture. I'm going to take a video. Sorry, I'm about out of water. And I'm trying to figure out how to do this <laughs> without pausing it. Um, so, yeah. I'm just looking for my phone. I get my phone and go get make a video. Well, I don't know if you can hear it at the beginning of the video. But, yeah. When we walk out to see what it was out of her room... It stops, of course, after it's been doing it for like 30 minutes. It's like, of course it is. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? So, yeah. So I do, I'll put that after this. Um, so you can see that. No, it won't be in black and white. You should be able to see it fine. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much what happened. 
Uh, and like I said, shit always happens up there. It's crazy. Out of water. Great. Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> um, but yeah, so yeah. And, and then the even better thing is she brought me home like two days later, whatever. And now I'm waiting on my dad to get over here and, you know, and I'm just hearing weird stuff. My house is not haunted. Trust me. It is not. I plead the blood over this house. So it better not be nothing. <laughs> better not be nothing. So, yeah. So basically, you know, I pretty much just keep hearing my dad talking, but obviously he's not here. So there's that. <laughs> um... And at first, you know, because I thought I heard his voice and I was like, oh, well, come on in. Open the door, looked out the screen. He was not there. Well, sit down. Because I was on the way to the bathroom. I sit down, listening to music, and then the doorknob starts jiggling. Down the front door now. Yeah. And I hear his voice again. And, of course, you know, I think it, it's him. Now, usually I answer the door with a knife, but I didn't do that this time. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, um, yeah. But I did answer it, and I didn't have a knife. And nobody there. He was not there. Sorry, car. I get distracted easily. Y'all should know that if you if you aren't new here. So basically, you know, my dad finally gets there. I'm telling him. But while this is happening to me, <laughs> ain't happening no more. But after this is happening to me, my best friend is messaging me that she's home alone. And well, except for with her son and they're downstairs. Excuse me. And where her parents live down, downstairs and they live up above. And she said that she was really freaked out. And I was like, oh, wow, what's going on? And she said she just heard somebody say, help, help. And I was like, which makes sense, though, because like I've said previously in other stories and stuff that, you know, have happened in her house. Yeah. <laughs> they used to play with a Ouija board before she was born like her, her uh, mom did and stuff. Yeah, which they don't have anymore, and then they, they, I don't know, they were into a bunch of stuff like that, um, but yeah, so that makes a lot of sense, and every time I go up there, something, something always has to happen, <sighs> but yeah, so anyway, uh, yeah, that's that, and I hope y'all enjoy the footage afterwards, not much to enjoy, but if y'all can find something that I missed or something, then awesome, that'd be really cool. Um, but anyways, until next time, stay tuned for more spooky stories. Okay, that was dumb. Stay tuned for more true scary stories of stuff that I've actually went through or whatever. Or whatever. Oh, God. I need to go to bed. Anyway, <laughs> hope y'all enjoyed that. And yeah, Just stay tuned. And I also do other shit besides this. So please like, comment, subscribe, and keep it rocking. There's a toy going off by itself in here. What toy was it? I don't know. What the fuck? I told you I'd get my camera out and it stopped. Oh, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> what the what? fuck was it? I just peeked around the corner and I could still hear it. And I heard it when I got up and I told you, I said, watch, I'm going to take my camera out and it's going to stop. It what? had to have been either that PJ Mouse thing or that... Um, bulldozer. What the hell? I think it was the PJ Masks thing.
I, I think, think it, it was, was too. I think it was that one because it was. It says. Why are you over here talking? Is says, there a cat over here? It says, "Cause in the night we saved the day," and that sounded like. You about to save the day somewhere else because you ain't sleeping beside me. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> you are not sleeping beside me. I rebuke you. Ooh. Man, I thought I was going to catch a ghost in here. <laughs>